what is your favourite thing about living in Rat Hill? Oh. oh, I have to say the pub. <laughs> is that is that not too bad or what? I lost my house on the 8th of October um, in a firestorm. The old house, in the morning I used to sit out on the veranda on the northern side and catch a bit of sun, read, have a cup of tea, say hello to people going past or whatever. Then in the afternoon I'd sit around on the western side veranda and have a beer. So it was, well, yeah, good. I hated being inside. So we're assisting Alan with the rebuild process in relation to the development application. So council is waiving DA fees for all bushfire um, destroyed properties and we're also, those DAs are processed within four to five days. But you can have any colour at all in the colour pond range. Yeah, I think we're going to do these two. I think that's going to be walls and roof. I changed a few things around with the design of the place, so yeah, I'm hoping it'll sort of have that same aspect. When Alan came in the first day, he was really upset and anxious and moving forward now, he's happy and he's excited for the build and it's really nice. Yeah, Amy, she's, she's a lovely little girl. Hey, how are you? Yeah, so, but I'm glad she's coming to help me pick out stuff because, uh, you know, I've got, I've got my ideas, but my ex-wife reckons they're not real flash, so. <laughs> I didn't think I'd be, um, <clears throat> well, I think I'm fairly strong, but I didn't think I'd be sort of as re resilient as I am. And that's what you've got to be. But there's support there too. So, you know, that's another thing. You've got to take it when it's offered, not be too proud. Well, that's why the pub's so good, you know. I mean, that's all we've got here. That's the only social thing, you know. We were, like after the fires and that, we were the, um, sort of getting together, a few of us had... Or well, the pub was open then, but then when the pub shut, we'd get together maybe Friday evenings and have a, sounds funny, but have a fire, because <laughs> it was winter, sit around a fire and talk, you know, it was good. Uh, I'd like to thank Red Cross, for sure, and the Salvation Army. Um, and the general community, um, people from Evans Head, um, yeah, anyone that's donated anything, you know, it's, it's, it was great. I just want people to know that in the same position as me, that not to give up hope, that something will happen eventually. <laughs>